Howdy everyone, I'm just making a video here to show off this new product that recently came out. Uh, it's basically a Wii Zapper uh, for the Switch. It's, it's, um, it's called the iPlay Game Gun. Very creative name. <laughs> but anyways, as you can see... I'm going to try to not say that phrase too much, but um, you put your Joy-Con in this gun-shaped peripheral and you can play pretty much any shooting game with it. Uh, you can even play any other game with it, you just I don't see why you would, but yeah. Uh, let's just not uh, go on a tangent, just show off what the gun looks like. Here it is, sorry I got like a little paper cut, so sorry for the band-aid. Uh, here's the gun, you can see um, my average hands are it's like, if it, it's not too big, not too small either, so nice size. It's not, it's not ambidextrous. Uh, you only need you it's only good for right-handed people because this piece here um, isn't present on the other side so you can actually put your finger through here but not through here and as you can see you can only put the right joy-con on the handle and the left joy-con on the barrel it looks really cool though like it's not like a comical color either um, you got like a red um, I don't know what it's called but the red part here and black it's just red and black not like a comical like blue color with some orange so yeah it looks pretty good it looks nice it's a nice feel for the on the grip the only problem that I could have, that someone could have, is this piece here. It's not very ergonomic. Like, you can kind of, uh, I would naturally hold it like this. I guess it's not proper, I guess. But, like, you can kind of, it feels kind of weird. So you kind of have to hold it a little higher. But even then, it's not perfect. But, hey, it's like first of its kind an official product and it's, uh, it's just so great to have one finally not much games you can play um right now actually there's a lot never mind i'm just i'm thinking about light gun games where you could boom, 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 aim and shoot like arcade style there are a few all right so anyways let's put the joy cons together um onto this thing. I only have one hand, so uh, let's uh, do our best. Okay, so the right Joy-Con goes through, goes through here. You kind of have to put it like that. Like put the the flat side in first, and then just push in from here. You could do the same to this side too. But let me demonstrate how to take it out. You just kind of push it from here. Push it up. You can use any side. But yeah. That's how you do it. And now for the left. Joy-Con again. Flat side in first. And push in from here. And to and you can see there's like a gap, a hole here, so you can still press on these and still like move around. And to push it out, you just push from that part again. Same thing. Nothing, no, no buttons are <coughs> kept from you. The only ones are the SL and SR buttons, the one on the flat sides, but there aren't any games that use those. 
except for arms but yeah so there you go set set up so let's um this you use this to aim this one to move around so you're basically gonna have to two-hand it like a shotgun really like that and move around like that <clears throat> there are some games where you know uh, you could only need one Joy-Con. I guess you'll add this for to make it look like there isn't a big gash in your gun and for some extra weight. But um, let's let's get some gameplay started. So I'll be right back and set up so uh, I can use both my hands and still have this gun in view. All right. Okay, got a match. I'm going to be holding this in a weird angle just so you guys can see me using it. So it's a little late in the, in the after midnight kind of deal, but okay, let's uh, let's zoom around with some booyahs. As you can see, oh uh, gosh, I'm using, I'm using that phrase again. Can look around, aim up and down with it, and pulling the trigger. Let's do some. Okay, let's do some playing now. This is great so far. Sorry if I'm gonna play like crap. It gives me tea. Let me just focus on the match. It's flanking. Oh gosh. <laughs> Looking good. This feels really good. <laughs> Now this is what, now this is a zapper, this is great, this is a wee zapper, oh gosh, okay, can't hide from me. Oh, that lasted not so long. That's not good, that's not good. I actually gotta kill this, <laughs> okay. Oh, really? <laughs> Okay, just gonna show you the swivel. Sorry, team. Okay, let's, let's get in there. Home stretch. Really? Some last turn. Okay, whatever. <laughs> okay, let's see how that went. Ah, <gasps> yep, we won. That's all thanks to this game gun. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> how did we lose? That does not look like we lost. Oh well. It was a lot. It was a lot of fun though. Wait, oh gosh, I need to stop saying that. Okay, um, let's try the next game. As you can, um, mm, yes, that's Splatoon 2. Let's try a different game. Okay, now we're playing 
Resident Evil Revelations 1. Uh, I got the second one as well. Right now, let's try the first one. Okay. Um, the weapon I'm using is a handgun, um, a machine gun, and a sniper rifle. It would definitely be a lot more fitting if I used a shotgun, but, uh, oh well, I can only hold three weapons in this game. I'm currently in raid mode right now. Um, if you want to be, like, a total nerd, feel more immersed, um, since I'm using, like, a one-handed weapon gun, you can actually just take this out and then use this by itself while holding this, so I'm just moving around. As you can see, I'm um, aiming with just the gun. Isn't that like a special reload motion? I guess not. Oh wait, I did. I did do it. Okay, let's try it again. Oh yes! That's so good. I love that. Oh my gosh. Imagine a game like uh, House of the Dead, uh, we gotta, imagine a game like House of the Dead where you're aiming and then you have to like do like this kind of motion to reload, man that would be amazing, but uh, let's change the uh, sensitivity, I put it, I put it as low here before, uh, let's go a little fast. Yeah, that's a little better. I can like, okay. I like the I like the kind of games where you have to hold the you kind of have to tog, um, toggle toggle the the motion aiming. I don't like it always on. Like it's always aiming around. It's better where like I can just rest my hand and then when I want to aim, I ready my aim and then hold the button. It's a lot better that way. Oh, hello. So yeah, I'm like shooting with a handgun right now, with one hand, even though that's not how you really shoot, and just like, be like, like this, if I want. Oh man, that's amazing! I freaking love that! We need more games like this. This game, oh my gosh. If you don't have this game on the Switch, I don't know, man, come on. This game is awesome. The fact that there's gyro aiming. And you have to waggle to reload. Dang, that's freaking... Oh, just House of the Dead arcade vibes. It's not perfect. Um, okay, there you go. Hmm, I'm gonna have to have the right motion, but let me tilt it a little so you, should, like, you can see a little more. Okay, let's pause. If I wasn't demonstrating right now, I would like do this without pausing like in real time. Like, oh, gotta switch to my other gun. This would be so, it would be so fun. But yeah, now, now that I'm two-handing my gun, I have to move around and ready my aim with this button here. I'm going to switch my weapon to a two-handed gun. Okay. Oh man, this is so cool. Okay, let's, uh, I'm just checking if you can see me using it. Like, of course, gyro aiming isn't perfect, like, compared to, like, IR sensor, but, like, on the Wii, but, hey, look, it feels so good. Like, you'll get used to it. It really feels like I'm, I'm like, oh my gosh, seriously. I remember, I remember, though, on the, the 3DS versions included, like, first-person aiming mode. I don't know why they removed that for this game though. It's 
kind of disappointing. The thing, the thing I love about uh, this game, though, is like most. Oh sh snap! <laughs> oh, you looking? Okay, let me just uh, take care of you. Switch to my sniper for some reason. But wow, this guy's aggressive. Oh my gosh! Imagine I die. Okay. You're not limping, so you are fine. Okay, this is taking a lot longer than usual. So. <laughs> I was hoping you would do like a the melee. <laughs> Like emotion melee, but whatever. Okay, that's done. Okay, what was I saying? I completely forgot, but anyways, this is freaking awesome. All right, let's just move on to the next game. Now we're playing the sequel Resident Evil Revelations 2. And we're playing as Hunk because he has the most weapons. Okay, let's uh, get started. What the frick is going on? Okay, this is my first time in this mission. Okay. Me being a nerd, I'm playing... To, I'm using the pistol. With, like, you know, the one-handed version. Uh, Okay, I need to kill that thing, whatever's happening. I don't even know what's going on. Okay, let's uh, quickly switch to a two-handed weapon. That's so cool, I love that. Okay, let's get started. If I get close enough, they get knocked down so I can do my double tap. Okay, he's dead. Oh, hey, you're alive. Not for long. Alright. Switch to a different weapon. Ooh. What the? What the heck? Is he capoeira? Creeper, creepy. Okay. This is awesome. Okay. It's really, it's really like I'm holding a shotgun. What the freak is going on with that? Where's this guy's weak point? Probably dodge. Yeah, I thought so. Where's this weak point? Gonna be total nerd. Woo! Bad, 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 bad. Woo! No. Personal space. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, I just feel like doing that. Got him, okay. okay. I'm worried about this thing running towards me. So uh, 
rest our hands a little bit. Okay. But sorry, I'm in an awkward position right now. Because I'm trying to get this whole thing in frame. Ooh, let's get rid of that guy. Okay, I think you got the idea. <laughs> I just, it just feels good to do that, even though you're not holding the gun right, just because you have that, that left Joy-Con. Let's do a little shotgun action, because this really feels like I'm holding a shotgun. Ooh, okay, buddy. That's uh, whoa. Okay, but you got the idea. Let's uh, prepare these guys first though. Ooh. I'm probably, yeah, I'm dead. Okay. Anyways, that's Resident Evil Revelations 2. First person shooter and start ripping and tearing with Doom. Okay, right now we only have two guns on this stage. Uh, that's fine. Okay, let's start. Okay, time to rip and tear. Okay. I forgot how to play. <laughs> oh yeah, that's how you nail it. Okay. Okay, let's switch our gun. Be a total nerd and one hand that Normally, um, I would play with the classic, um, way of hold, of uh, the gun being in the middle of the screen, but yeah, that's fine. Ooh, it's not good. Oops. Let's, uh, switch our gun. Let's, uh... I completely forgot how to play. <laughs> Let's get some help. There you go. Yeah, I'm not doing a great job with the one-handed... I'm losing my immersion. But Quickly, okay, I didn't quickly switch. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Oof. Uh, we gotta wait till it loads again, but you can see that um, it works really well still. I, I'm like, Amy, let me like, be in a controlled environment and show, show you how the swivel works. Okay, let me like move around with this. So, oh, okay. Okay, let's uh, have a little test. And you can, you can always um, adjust your aim a little bit if it's a little off. And you can always change the, sens the sensitivity to make it feel just right for you. I don't really have time to adjust the sensitivity since I just got this um, gun. It's really cool, really, really cool. It's gonna be a 
keep telling me. <laughs> oh jeez. The one handed. Yeah, so oh, god yeah, rip and tear. Yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> yeah, this is amazing. Alright, so I guess that's Doom. Let's uh move on with the next game. Alright, let's get started. Yeah. Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now this is a shooting game. All right. Leroy Jenkins. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, rip and tear, boys. Hey, come on. Yeah. Ugh, you need more. work. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Okay. Woo! Now this is what this. Now this is what this game, this gun is made for. Tearing my butt. Who needs us this? Who needs us this? I got a gun. I got a gun. Who needs us this? Yo, get out of here. Mm, bang, bang. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. Mm. Hey, come on. Do the thing. There you go. Now this is how you play Dark Souls. <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, let's uh let's play the actual game. Alright, here we go. So, in conclusion, this Switch Joy-Con Zapper game the peripheral, the iPlay game gun, is a must-buy. You have to buy it, dude. If you love shooting games, I highly recommend it. Uh, you can get it on Amazon for like $20. Honestly, I would pay $30 for this thing. I don't know. You can get it for cheaper if you want, but anyways, yeah, yeah it's, it's a must buy, dude. You need to, you need to get it, to get it, you need to get it. Alright, see you later.